all right y'all so right now we finna check out look back at it miss my lotto well uh my lotto you know what i'm saying she big lotto now so she dropped the miss i don't know why she dropped the miss maybe it was like too much it's crazy because she dropped the miss then boom i feel like her career just went even further but i don't know it's crazy look back at it that's the that's the song name um if y'all have a specific song y'all think i should check out let me know down below in the comments um it don't even have to be mulatto it could be anybody any album whatever the case let me know um yeah leave a like comment subscribe the likes definitely go a long way and show me that you really rocking with the content that i'm putting up um because sometimes they don't be request videos so i just be checking out stuff that i feel like i like you know what i'm saying or I wanted to check it out just because I feel like this artist kind of has some sort of uh, intriguing, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. But just let me know down below, up there now, so I know. It's crazy because if you think about it, and I know I kind of want to hear her answer the question. If she would have took the deal from Jay, if she would have took the deal, do she think she would have been in the same position? Because Moom, if it wasn't enough money, at the end of the day, you still could could have been further or whatever the case. Like she could have been in this position maybe two years ago, a year ago, you know what I'm saying? Because Potentially he got have connections or whatever the case he could have put her in a spotlight. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I just want to hear her like obviously was like If you would have been if you would have needed the money, you know what I'm saying if you would have really really needed the money Or some sort if you would have just basically signed the deal How different you think your career would have been you know what I'm saying because I don't even know if she signed somebody or not right now I believe she is I believe she is, but I don't know who exactly. But um, she said booty so big, she don't even need to look back at it. And then she said, uh, she said something about basically. Um, she says she said something that was kind of it caught my ear. She said basically kind of talk to the dude, and they basically have like relations, and then she don't even call him back. Like that's a bad habit she got. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy like she really in her bag right now you know what i'm saying i mess with it you know what i'm saying like she getting to it and she ain't running about nobody else you know what you know what's crazy though i feel like that relationship she was in like i feel like obviously she cared about dude because she was with him for so long i think i don't know how long they've been together i just felt like i guess it's it been a long time for me i'm, I'm not keeping track you know what i'm saying but i'm just saying like Anyway, I felt like after the after the fact, like doing whatever happened, I don't know exactly what happened, but whatever happened, they broke up whatever the case. And she bossed up. Like she I feel like at this point it's like I ain't gonna let nobody else do that to me. Like I'm finna just boss up on everybody. Like I don't care. And that's just crazy to me. Like females I ain't gonna lie, when they boss up, they really boss up. You know what I'm saying? Like dudes, you know what I'm saying? You could tell, like, all right, bro, bro, on a different level. But when females do it, it's like, I ain't gonna lie, it's more motivating than seeing a dude stuff like this, and she's just letting you know already out the gate, like, bro, you know I bossed up, chill. They got some take the camera. Hmm. Think I should take the camera. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You still getting me? Huh? So you still getting me? Can you leave it right now, right now? Not right now. I'm gonna take them out. Yeah, they're not gonna be done by then. But I really don't need them because I still haven't edited the other videos. So that's the problem. But uh, the reason why I added this clip before my videos is because I feel like people expect me to put the whole entire video inside of my video, which they could just go watch the actual video if they wanted to have or see the whole video well it's because of copyrighted reasons you know what i'm saying it's a copyrighted issue you know if you take if you if 
if I get, if I want to make my own barbecue sauce, and I literally just steal the, their ingredients right off the back of the, the bottle or whatever the case, I could easily get sued. But if I use salt or some sort of other ingredient to add to it or maybe take away, then I easily could sell my own barbecue sauce. I mean, I just need this video to be two minutes. That's why it's dragging out this long, but. Yeah. Well, the way I with the camera. I look sexy. Excuse me? I'm sexy and I know it. I'm just gonna touch you. I'm getting another tape break. I let them hit it once and never call it's a bad habit. That part right there. Damn. We had the same 24. That's crazy. It's, it, when you look at it like that, it makes it seem like so easy and so simple. You know what I'm saying? Like, boom, we got the same 24 hours. So you would expect like everybody that's working hard should be in the right positions. You know what I'm saying? But not, not really though. You know what I'm saying? Because if you think about it, I feel like I feel like that goes into a, a lot, a lot of other stuff. Cause it, it matter like a, people you hang around with too. You know what I'm saying? Like you could be working your ass off, like really working hard, but that that person that's around you could give you a negative vibe or negative energy. You know what I'm saying? Like boom, let's say you you your artist. Every time this person around you, they're like, nah. You know what I'm saying? Like, we ain't going to the studio. Let's go. Let's go. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. Let's go see what this girl doing, or let's go see what this person doing, or, you know what I'm saying? Let's go here, let's go there. Besides, like, really just chasing the bag and chasing the dream, you know what I'm saying? They out trying to do foolish stuff, you know what I'm saying? Sidetracking, you see what I'm saying? So it's like, you could be working hard, but the people that you care about or the people that you be around could potentially be holding you back, you know what I'm saying? So I feel like it just matter, like, you kind of have to self-evaluate every now and then and be like, all right, this person, I'm probably, I'm probably, I'll probably be in a better position or further if this person wasn't around, you know? For real though, that's how it be.